Superfly National Champion, top yeah. 155 flat. Yeah. Did that surprise you? you that a little bit, you? yeah. I, I mean, it hurt on the last 50, and my stroke kind of fell apart, and I started bending my knees, and so I was, that's usually never a good thing. But um, I must have been out like 53 then, yeah? Did you do yeah. No, if you were 54 2 2. Okay, well, then I didn't die as much as I thought did I did. You knew you'd have to go out that fast if you wanted to have a shot at that? Yeah, yeah. We were talking this morning. I think I was like. 55 mid and then like 101 high, 102 low. And I was like, okay, like honestly, like my best shot is to pump the first 100 because my back 100's just never been that good. And I think that was the best back 100 I've ever had. So, new plan. Talk, talk us through the last 20 meters when your stroke was about, was, was like this. Yeah. Um, you know, I like, there's a line on the bottom at 25 and I was like, and I that was like the one stroke where I kind of hopped back up on top of the water and I was like, damn it. It's a long way to go still. <laughs> um, but I was like, I just hold it together. Like I knew there was some people over on the other side of the pool, but I couldn't really tell if I was ahead or behind, but I was just like, okay, just hope, just hope, just hope. And um, you know, that was like all I thought all race, really. The whole first 175, I didn't really uh, think. So I think that's a good plan. How about the earlier in the end of the race? Yeah, um, very, very happy. I mean, I think I yelled and hit the water, which is like, I think the only time I've ever done that was in CAA's on your back, which is always like an emotional win. Um, you know, I've never really won, never won a national title long course. And uh, I always thought my first one, if I ever would ever get one, would be the 100 fly. But to do it in the 200, um, like I know uh, certain someone didn't do it, but um, I'm really happy with it. And there's just so many good um, flyers, young and old, in the States right now. So I think it's a pretty cool title. Tom, you've come up with your elbows before, I've never seen before. Yeah. Um, yeah, totally. I just think like from point A to point B, it's just easier to do like that. I don't know how much I was bit like bending them, but you know what I mean. Like I like I don't like that whole because I have such a hard time speeding up my recoveries. Anyways, we've been thinking a lot, a lot about it. So thanks for this. How about the no, nervous time? Yeah, you've come a long way since the beginning of this season. Yeah, can you tell us the time difference from your in-season turn fly Holy crap. to this one? Um, Fourteen you? seconds. You were 14 yeah, seconds. I went 209 at Mesa. That was my very first. Yeah, kind of my very first 200 fly of this true summer season. Um, I had this chest infection. I mean, my, my emotions were in the dump. I just felt like terrible. And uh, we figured it out once the doctor trained hard and dropped 14 seconds on the season. I dropped only two seconds. So how about the nervous thing? This morning you qualified fourth in your heat. I thought I was out. When that happened, I didn't really know who was in the third heat. I got out of the water and I was like, holy crap, like I didn't find them. Because, I mean, if you're getting fourth in a three, um, heat, circle seated, sucks. Like, that's signs aren't good. You know, so I was just like, man, I'm out. And then uh, this, the last heat went, I was like, oh, thank God, like I made it. And that was actually a really big like motion that happened there. Yeah. When you heard the coach was coming back, but he wasn't going to do the 200 fly. Were you thinking that? Oh man, you know, I um, I put very little thought into that because a lot of people were saying a lot of things. And you know, it's like I, I, the way I figured, I can't control him. I can't control. Um, anyway, you know, just name people off the list that I can't control. Um, you know, if he, if he wanted to, he, he could. I, I'm not going to deny that. Uh, um, but, you know, we've heard so many things for so long that I was like, okay, like, if he comes back, he comes back. If he doesn't, he doesn't. Like, nothing really changes for me. So I didn't really think about it. Hey, Tom, what made you hold on today? Where you, when, it, when it was hurting, you seemed like you were able to power a little bit at the end. Yeah, I didn't want to wait till Friday. What happened last year, I got third in the 200 fly. Um, at trials and I was like man I haven't made a team yet I've never made a team and that was such a burden for me emotionally so I just uh, I want to do it right now I want to get it done so the 100 fly can be a little bit more fun and a lot less nerve-wracking and it's going to be so I'm stoked for that last question I'm sorry, sorry, sorry my bad. yeah no, no. how have you trained yourself to, be, to not be scared of pain like that at the end of the team um you know honestly the 200 fly it doesn't hurt as bad as 100 um, I hold my breath for the last six to seven strokes of the 100 so um, to be completely honest the 100 is more about like ability to finish it's not pain for me. Other people can speak for themselves. I gotta go, guys. Right. Thanks, Thanks. Tom. Appreciate it. Yeah.